everyone! Today, we're going to study solving word problems involving subtraction. Did you know that dolphin sizes vary from 4 feet to 30 feet, while whale sizes vary from 31 feet to 150 feet? If a dolphin is 75 feet long, and a whale is 285 feet long, how much longer is a whale than a dolphin? In able to solve this, we're going to answer the following question. First, what facts is or are given in the problem? Next, what does the problem ask for? Third, what operation shall be used to answer the problem? Fourth, what is the number sentence? Fifth, show the solution. And lastly, write the answer with the correct label. So let's answer the problem using this guide question. What are the given? So the given are 75 feet long and the wheel is 285 feet. Next, what is asked in the problem? How much longer is a whale than a dolphin? Next, what operation are we going to use? Very good! We're going to use subtraction. After that, let's write the number sentence. In writing the number sentence, big number minus smaller number is equal to n. So we have 285 minus 75 is equal to n. Let's write the solution. In writing the solution, you need to align the numbers according to their place value. And we're going to start subtracting from the ones place. So 5 minus 5 is equal to... Very good, that's 0. Next, 8 minus 7 is equal to... Good job, that is 1. Then, what are we going to do to 2? Very good, we're going to bring it down. So the final answer is, the whale is 210 feet longer. Let's have the next number. Rio paid 126 pesos for her chocolate ice cream. How much change did she receive if she gave the seller 500 pesos? Again, let's find the given. We have... 126 pesos and 500 pesos. Then, what is asked in the problem? How much change did she receive if she gave the seller 500 pesos? Again, children, what operation are we going to use? Very good! We're going to use subtraction. Then, let's write the number sentence. We have... 500 minus 126 is equal to n. We can now write the solution. Again, in writing the solution, align the numbers according to their place value. So we have 500 minus 126. So we're going to start from the ones place. 0 minus 6 cannot be. That's why we're going to borrow the first one's equal digit, which is digit 5. 5 will become 4, then the middle 0 will become 9, then the 0 from the 1's place will become 10. 10 minus 6 is equal to 4. Then let's proceed to the 10's place. 9 minus 2 is equal to, very good, that's 7. Then 4 minus 1 is equal to, good job, that is 3. So the final answer is 374 pesos. Let's have the next problem. There were 5,678 pupils who took part in a marathon. 3,892 of them were boys. How many girls took part in the marathon? So to answer this, let's find the given. We have... 5,678 and 3,892. What is asked in the problem? 
how many girls took part in the marathon. Then again, children, what operation are we going to use? That's correct. It's subtraction. Let's write the number sentence. We have 5,678 minus 3,892 is equal to N. We can now write the solution. Again, don't forget to align the numbers according to their place value. Let's start from the 1's place. 8 minus 2 equals... Very good, that's 6. Then, 7 minus 9. Since 7 is smaller than 9, we can't subtract them. That's why we're going to borrow 1 from 6. So 6 will become 5. Then 7 will become 17. So 17 minus 9 equals, good job, it's 8. Let's proceed to the hundreds place. We have 5 minus 8. Since 5 is smaller than 8, we can't subtract them. That's why we're going to borrow 1 from 5. 5 will become 4. Then 5 at the hundreds place will become 15. So 15 minus 8 equals, very good, it's 7. Then let's proceed to the thousands place. We have 4 minus 3. 4 minus 3 is equal to? Very good, it's 1. So the final answer is 1,786 girls. Always remember children, in solving word problems, you need to answer the guide questions below. First, what facts is or are given in the problem? Next, what does the problem ask for? Next, what operation shall be used to answer the problem? Next, what is the number sentence? Next, you need to show the solution. And lastly, write the answer with the correct label. 